I have to start mm-hmm. with um, it's not even a scandal. I wouldn't. It's obviously, it's not a scandal, but I have to start with the issues that were brought to your doorstep. Um, I think two, two, or three, <laughs> two or three Why? weeks ago. Will this, uh, will this stop punching me? <laughs> two or three weeks ago. Lord. Yeah. Um, so, um, of course, uh, the Kenya team is heading over to the Olympics. Um, it's a fantastic time to be able to showcase stuff about um, our country and show our style and designs and all of those things. Mm. And so, obviously, the Ministry of, of, of Sports is in charge of that mandate. And um, they created, uh, well, at the end of the day, what was produced was a <sighs> something that you know was, it left left a lot to be desired, right? In from the Kenya from the Kenyan perspective, and you know, I I'd, 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 I would agree, right? And then you know, slowly, um, people who participated in the process or people who were involved in the process, um, their names were were being dropped on Twitter because right now we're in the space of accountability, we're in the space of we want to understand what exactly is going on. And so your name popped up as one of the... There was a name and a video. <laughs> a name and a video had popped up as one of the, the people who were part of um, the committee that went into the process of, um, of uh, this final thing. First, I think that thing was very targeted. You think so? It was. I think it was being used as a deflection from By the who? pressure. I, I, I do want to say who. Okay. I don't want to start saying. Right, right. Because the person who said, yeah, yeah, you need to ask these people and threw our names on the internet. Yeah. After I did my statement, they deleted, they deleted the post. Oh, really? Yeah. And the person, who, the person who started that chain, are they connected in any way to the ministry? Was it? You never know. We shall never know. Okay. Will we ever know? Okay. We shall never know. So you think they were trying to, to change um, the you attention to, from the ministry to now to you guys? shift blame. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you know, I know two other people who are on that committee because I have an auntie um, who's who's on there. Lucy Rao is is, is my is auntie. Your auntie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Shout know what that. Lucy. I don't know what that laugh is. Do you, do, do you know Lucy put me on my first flight? Oh really? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, Lucy was the first person who made me. Leave this country airplane. for 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 what? for a fashion thing yeah. in Bujumbura. Okay. Yeah, I can remember it was in 2014. Yeah, and I went to Bujumbura for Bujumbura, the very first edition of Bujumbura Fashion yeah. Week. Yeah. I feel like I should even call her Auntie Lucy because I'm like, she, like she's she's you know like my mom's my mom's brother's mm. um you know wife. So anyway, so then uh, then then obviously because Liz Liz who's even been on the on this podcast as well. Um, anyway, so tell us, you know, what, I mean, I know you put out your statement and said, um, that you had very limited, uh, I, th- I think there are a lot of things, <laughs> factors that people don't want to talk about. Yeah. And again, since, uh, people want to, I get it. People are trying to get accountability and yeah. everything, but it's important how people need to understand a lot of things that happen. Number one, we didn't design those clothes. Yeah, we were not brought in as designers. Yeah. We were brought in to look at the submissions that had been brought in. Yeah, yeah. Even as they brought us in in February, mm-hmm. I told them, I said in the call when I was being, I said, "This is a bit, a little bit late. This is work that should have been done last year." So this thing started this year. Yes. Okay. This should, work should be done last year. However, we can make it work yeah. quickly yes. if we be fast. Mm-hmm. Secondly, there were submissions. So whether good or bad, whatever the submissions were there, we had to work within what was there. What was presented. Yeah. Okay. So when Sagaita like there are better designs, no one submitted their designs for the competition. Yeah. Not everyone. Like even I know like very many designers mm. who I think are amazing and who I think can do so much. People didn't submit designs. Did that anything? That, did that have anything to do with the cash uh, being awarded? Because I had a conversation with someone I will not say who, um, um, who was on that uh, committee, and they told me that they felt that was part of the challenge because the cash prize or the monies that were being awarded 
was not incentive enough for the top designers to be like, this is a project I want to participate in. Because it was, it was 300,000, was it? I think. Yeah. I don't think it's the cash price. I just think like people who have dealt with the Gava don't want to touch Gava again. Mm. Me included. I, 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 now you're... <laughs> just like, I couldn't do it. <laughs> yeah. Like, I don't know what you'd need to convince me to... To touch to, another, to touch another project. Another yeah. Gava project. Because yeah. I was just like, that is some crazy... Yeah. I don't know what that So people means. just did not submit good designs. There were people, just no, no good designs. No, they were just they were good designs. Yeah. There were designs. Let's okay. say, let's say I don't want to I don't want to be the person saying No, I mean it has to be subjective, you know. It if something's be, good or bad. I feel like, like the the designs were there. Yeah. Um there was a lot of other factors. Um <laughs> the designs were the designs were there yeah. even from what we shortlisted. Yeah. Even what was picked, yeah. the designs were there. Yeah. Um, there are a lot of factors, again, with this specific uniform that were, di were different, which I have to actually give credit to the, to the ministry. Okay. Because they involved the athletes in even the selection process. Okay. Yeah, they did involve the athletes. Okay. Like athletes, I, I feel like people, Kenyans want what they want. At the end of the day, the athletes are the ones who are wearing those clothes. Yes. So they are saying... So okay. they had a choice. They, they had, had a, a say in the matter. Yeah, they were like, we don't want this, we don't want this. And there are things they just picked out and there are things... They picked as options from what we had shortlisted. Okay. Yeah. So after we submitted the yeah. shortlist and everything, things went how they went. Um, production took was done in a very short period. Mm -hmm. Because what people witnessed were actual, I think, were supposed to be like samples. Um, were samples. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. When did you... Let me ask you, because... I know that uh, you are on the ground protesting and the, you know the the finance bill the first day of the protest. I know I know I saw videos where you were there um and my my sister-in-law also told me that she saw you. Um so you are participating in this process of um you know holding the government accountable and stuff like that. So in this context now of when when people started talking about the att attire when did you know that or when did you first think, okay, this thing is going to come to my door? This accountability I, I thing. I knew it in April before. Oh, you knew it was going to be. It was going to come. I knew it was coming. I just didn't know in what to what magnitude. Yeah, because I could already see um, the delay, mm. and you know our faces already plastered on social media. Yeah. So it's just like this thing is is going to be an issue. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, thoughts when it first, when, you know, when, you know, when now it's actually landed at your door, what were your first thoughts? Because it took you, what, maybe about 24 hours, 14 hours before you actually put no, up the, the statement? No, it took me like six, eight hours. Oh, to really, oh, from Not when? Not really, actually. It didn't take that long. Yeah. Because it's, what, the, my name cropped up at 12. I did the statement at 6 p.m. So within six hours, you're like, this is. Like, because yeah. it was like, it was like, guys became personal. Yeah. Guys left Twitter, they are now coming to <laughs> Instagram. <laughs> yeah. They're like, Mboro na Valisha, athletes, it was just like, eh, yeah, guys. Yeah. Yeah. And then they like, also like, yeah, yeah, it was, it was, a, it was a lot. I know people don't want to usually act like, oh, yeah. you know, being trolled. I mean, Co Connie, Connie left Twitter, if I'm not wrong, and then, oh, she's back. and then came back. Yeah. She's back. It, it had got, it, yeah. it, it was very nasty. It was very nasty. Wow. And even with her, they got so personal. Yeah. Um, they went after her family. Okay. Um, yeah, it, That's it unfortunate. Was, it, 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 yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit... It's a Worth bit it? How much money did they pay you guys? What as a money? Consultancy? Oh, my God. Have you not been paid? <laughs> you want to tell me 30K? Is, and this is the thing. <laughs> this is the thing. And people uh, want to... To Nini. Yeah. To focus on payment. So when we got there, the thing was, we asked, was like, is there remuneration, remuneration for, participate, yeah. for participating? Yeah. If there isn't, let us know. So that we so know that, that we are doing it for patriotic. You're just like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're like, I'm here to serve my country. This is what we are doing. Yeah. And uh, happily, I would have done it. And yeah. it wasn't a problem for yeah. me. So they said, yeah, yeah, there's remuneration. And there wasn't like any communication about it. So when we started getting ghosted mm -hmm. and the communication, there wasn't like proper communication. Um, I'll talk based you, on yeah, my yeah, experience. Yeah, yeah. Um, one day they 
and then it's so funny because I don't know if Gava imagines that you're not doing any other thing. So they call you to things in the evening mm-hmm. for tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> this podcast was planned yeah. for two weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. Um, they would text you, text you at 6 or 4 p.m. and say, hey, we need, we need you here tomorrow at this time. <laughs> then it's like, eh, guys, I actually... Like I, I have, yeah, I yeah. run my own business, so I am. Um, I have to meet clients and be, you know. So they they invited us for something. I think it was a hundred days to Olympics. Mm-hmm. They sent an invite. Then I, I was like, if I have time, I'll come. Um, if I finish work early because it was an evening thing. Yeah. Uh, if not, tough. Uh, yeah. So I managed to finish the the things I had to do that day early. And left. So in the course of the day, a number sent me 30k. Mm-hmm. No message, no nothing. No it's reference. Like, was no, like, mm-hmm. There wasn't just like, I was just sent 30k in silence. Um, so we, when I got to the grounds, one of the people in, in, the, in the committee was like, hey, did you receive some money? It's like, yeah, I received 30k. I didn't understand what, what, it, what it was for. Yeah. I thought it was a client. I was just waiting to know which client mm, because that mm. I don't know that person. It's like, yeah, I called the number. Uh, it's money from the ministry. I'm like, yeah. So what? What is the thirty k for? Is it for the session? Mm. Is it, I like, what is it a deposit? Like, <laughs> it didn't. It didn't make any sense. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah. I I I, I we, and I asked and no, nothing was written back or responded back. To yeah. Me. In that context, and so that that was that. That was like it was just. I was like, I guess, um, yeah. I, I, literally, that's what happened. I feel like people are hoping. However, yeah. A figure cropped up online. Yeah. On that thread, that's why I'm like the thread was. Deleted. What was the figure? They because I, I didn't actually see that. They one. said one fifty. I was mm. like, that's how I knew someone had probably leaked this information from. Mm, to from yeah, it's either the ministry directly or someone give some a third party the yeah. information because then that's when I I figured I guess we're supposed to be paid one fifty and there's a one twenty balance that hasn't that uh, not balance but there's a one twenty that someone probably just oh it uh, yeah. <laughs> it came out but I, it didn't yeah, it didn't reach so it was on that that's what I'm saying yeah I just realized because I was like I was like okay. Now you have you, that you have <laughs> managed to breathe. Yeah, just go and revisit and see what. Yeah, the post was deleted. Okay, the post was deleted. So like, because the person was like, "Oh, that whole thing is costing 150 million. Like it was a lot. The person who did the breakdown had given a lot of details. Yeah, that even me who was, was part, part of the project, of the didn't, project have. didn't have. Okay, so I guess yeah. Okay. So after silence and after the stuff with the I didn't know we were just told oh the costumes are ready guys uh, we are launching them again same thing we are launching them come and someone from the office really calls like I th- we think you should really be there you, th- you should come and see them so I was skeptic but then I was like just go see so I went to see gosh yeah. my phone is really ringing mm. I went to I went I went to see and there's like. The moment they were just and was like, this is not good. Yeah. This is not good. Even before it, the, the images hit the internet. Yeah. It's like, this is not. It's going to be chaos. This is going to be chaos. Okay. Yeah, because, Final question on uh, this. Huh? Uh, um, and this I'm also, I'm, I'm, ref, I'm bringing it out from the, I think, uh, the Twitter community that I saw people talking about the obsession with the Maasai um, shoe cars in the designs and in, in constantly, what seeming, seems like constantly borrowing only from the Maasai um, tribe and the Maasai culture as a representation of Kenya. Um, so even in the designs that you guys got, were all of them just in that theme? Not all of them. Yeah. Um, that specific one yeah. was because ideally the dress was supposed to have beadwork okay. along the... Right, the the details, the details right. you'll see, and they're supposed to have beadwork, but now it's been done with embroidery. Yeah, again, I, I guess it's because of time and yeah. everything. Um, based on what we had discussed at w- that was there, um, 
like like when we were shortlisting everything, that design was supposed to be beadwork. Yeah. So, um, that is again. Not all great designers submitted their designs. Yeah. And there were things that the ministry had also listed that need requirements that the designs did need to meet. Ah, right, 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 right. If the design didn't meet those requirements, yeah. And so if, if something didn't have any culture in it, they didn't it make was, it. it. Didn't make it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And it was because again, yeah, we were brought in on yeah. rules that already been set. Yeah. On how to judge those, the the pieces and yeah. this and make the short list. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and, makes sense. and and people are clowns. I feel like sometimes Kenyans need to be a bit serious, <laughs> because like some guys used to guys were pulling Rurashio clothes and sending them as submissions. Right. <laughs> for real, I'm not. I'm. I'm just not saying it. It's just like yeah. you sit. We, we sat for the first two sessions, and yeah. it was painful to, to go through the to designs. go through the, the 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 things that people had sent. Yeah. Yeah. It was hard. How many submissions were there? Do you remember? It was a lot. It was almost almost a hundred of a hundred. Yeah. Yeah. It was a lot of submissions. Yeah. I don't remember that, but it was a lot. Like, it was a lot. Like people would just put t-shirts. People. Someone even put like the the current like the 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 was it? It's called honeycomb. The the thing. Yes. Someone submitted that as as a thing as a, that they are going to do. So it's like, so it it wasn't original. It wasn't. Mm. Mm, it wasn't comfortable. Mm. It wasn't going to work with like para Paralympics. Like a lot of those things were not people were not considering. Yeah, they were sending. Um, yeah, that 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 stuff. Okay, well, so it a lot a lot. There's a lot that um, was happening, and I know like guys are again. I'm the accountability part, a hundred percent for yeah. people. But there, there are a lot of other things behind the scenes. I could see people generating AI, like this would be great. This mm. would be great. I'm like, yeah, but no one submitted. Mm. The mm. call was out. Yeah, and no one submitted. People didn't submit. Submitted. So like, there are just the few people who submitted. That's what happened. There was even a point where the committee was like, or should we just, um, not use, the, the whole thing and get another designer. Then they said it would be a waste of money because because they had already started their process. That's process. Tough, uh, tough. I guess uh, you know because, this life uh, is not. Uh, it's, it's not, it's easy, not yeah. easy. Yeah, it's not easy. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, All right. Yeah.